In this lesson, you will learn to use push buttons with digital inputs to turn an LED on and off. Pressing the button will turn the LED on. Pressing the other button will turn the LED off. Components required. One Elegoo Mega 2560 R3. One eight three a tie points breadboard. One five millimeters red LED. One to two R ohm resistor. Two push switches. Seven mm wires, male to male jumper wires. First, we install the red LED on the breadboard. Then we connect one end of the resistor to the positive LED of the LED. We add the two push switches to the board. Using a male to male wire we now connect one end to the negative LED LED and the other one to the negative line on the breadboard. Now we connect the negative line to the ground outlet pin on the Elegoo 2560 board. We connect the first pin on the push switch to the outlet pin number 9. The second pin is connected to the negative line. The first pin on the second switch is connected to the outlet pin number 8. The second pin is connected to the negative line on the breadboard. The last wire is used to connect the resistor to the outlet pin number 5. After all the components are added, we can connect the USB cable to the Mega 2560 board to load the code from the computer. Switches are really simple components. When you press a button or flip a lever, they connect to contacts together so that electricity can flow through them. Although the bodies of the switches are square, the pins protrude from opposite sides of the switch. This means that the pins will only be far enough apart when they are placed correctly on the breadboard. Remember that the LED has to have the shorter negative lead to the left. Thanks for watching and subscribe for more videos.